answering a bunch of questions that I got from my subscribers. So this particular question came in from a guy who is a um, new graduate. He studied computer science and applied mathematics, and he's struggling to figure out what to do with that knowledge, like what career should he go into. He was interested in doing systems analyst, but then he found that there weren't that many jobs for systems analyst, and he kept seeing business analysts, and that's how he kind of found my channel and ended up sending me an email about it so I already did a video you can go check that out where I did a video talking about um, the difference between systems analyst and business analyst and whether or not he should be looking into that um, career so you can go watch that video to get more details about the differences between them and where they came from and what the system analyst does all that stuff is in that video so go check it out now the other questions you had was um, is there another name for systems analyst position? I'm thinking maybe some companies call it differently. Um, so maybe that's why he's not finding the job. No, not, ne not necessarily. I mean, every company is calling their job by whatever name. Like I see business analyst jobs that are called different things, but when you look at the, the, the job requirement, it's really business analysis, right? So everybody's calling things differently. Um, you could look for, I don't know, systems engineer, um, Sometimes even architect, you could look for a software architect or a systems architect, and you might find something similar. But every company sometimes just call the jobs. <laughs> there is no rhyme or reason to why they call things. Sometimes it doesn't really make sense. So you just have to search for those other terms and see what comes up. Um, the other question he has is, since I see business at its position, do you think it is an ideal job? I should consider and why so uh, you should do business analysis if you really match the personality of a business analyst not everybody is cut out for this job right so I have a video that talks about is the business analyst role right for you please go check that out because that will explore certain innate traits that you have as a person that could help you gauge whether or not the business analyst role would fit your personality because it's not going to fit everybody. Some people are just not going to be happy doing this stuff. So you want to do something that you're happy in. You want to do something that you enjoy, that you, you know it aligns to your skills. So check that video out. That will give you some tips on what to gauge with yourself. And you can, by the end of the video, you can know. You can know if it's going to be a good role for you or not. Um, so that really can give you some pointers there. Um, and should you consider it, you know, also you need to understand what the job role entails. So I have another video that talks about the business analyst job role, who you'll be working with, the environment, everything what you should be expecting when you get a job as a business analyst. Watch that video as well to give you a good sense of, is this something you even want to be doing every day? And then I have another video, right, that actually you can follow me for the day and see you know, what is the typical day of a business analyst like? And when you watch that video, you can understand some of the things I do in a typical day. And that could also give you insight as to whether or not, you know, this would be a useful job for you or something that you would enjoy. The worst thing you want to do is start off your career after how many years in college doing something that you just don't like. Somebody of us do it and we... We do something, we don't like it, we try something else, we don't like that, we try something else, and we eventually find the thing that we like. So if if we if I can help you cut out those years of suffering <laughs> and learn from like my mistake and other people's mistake, then that's great. You the fact that you're here already is good because I didn't know business analysts existed. I didn't know what this was. Nobody told me what to expect or you know what a day in the life of a business analyst was. I had to struggle to figure all this out. So I'm giving you this as a free gift. Um, the least you can do is go find out for yourself. So watch those videos I pointed to, and that will give you answers to whether or not this is a good job for you, whether or not um, you know this would be ideal. And if you're look, if you're still very very tied to the systems analyst job, you can easily go um, 
look for other names, software architect, systems architect, uh, systems engineer, things like that. But really it's the job description you need to be reading to see what are they doing. And if what they're doing aligns with what you, you, you're good at, then you know that this would be a job that you could do. All right, I'm gonna answer some more questions. Come right back, I'll be right back. See you in the next video, take care.